This video is sponsored by Diecast Airplane Store. Hello YouTube, welcome back to another review video. Today I would like to review Centurion Cargo's McDonnell Douglas MD-11F by Gemini Jets. The mold is outstanding. I don't seem to find anything odd about it. The colors are nicely replicated. One noticeable flaw with the print is that there is visible yellow paint in some areas inside the engines. Besides that, everything else is nice and crisp. Despite the small seam, this crate amount is susceptible. The wings are beautifully done along with the winglets. Two flaws that I found are that there's a small area of overgloss paint on the top of the right wing and the bottom of the left wing. The engines and pylons appear to be made from metal. The engine vortex generators are delightfully done. The inside of the engines are gray with small areas of yellow paint and the exhausts are phenomenally done. The landing gear appears to be metal, while the wheels are rubber. Only the middle main landing gear wheels roll. The rest are a little bit stiff. Overall, I recommend you guys this model, especially if you love to collect freighters. Well that concludes our review for Centurion Cargo's McDonnell Douglas MD-11F by Gemini Jets. If you have this model, let me know what you think about it in the comment section. Please, like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for the latest reviews. This is Alpha and hope to have you guys back again soon.